Welcome to another update from Force 13 and currently on the screen is another look at what is at this point in time Tropical Depression 15 a W with the local name Young Dawi. 15 W is currently located according to the Joint Times Warning Centre 29 decimal 3 degrees north. 126 decimal 7 degrees east, maximum sustained winds 30 knots, gusting 40, and is around 178 nautical miles north northwest of Kadena Air Force Base, tracking northward at 7 knots. However, they have updated their information. They have it 285 nautical miles southeast of Shanghai, China, tracking west southwest at 5 knots. Animated MSI shows the central convection has slightly re consolidated and obscuring the low level circulation. The theta bends to the south, all but shadow and fragmented have also wrapped back towards the low level circulation. And Tropical Depression 15W has slightly improved, upper level outflow remains limited to the subsidence or subsidence from the mid latitude low to the east. However, vertical wind shear remains low and are on track sea surface temperatures are uh, around 28 to 29 degrees Celsius. However, the environment at this point in time remains marginally uh, favourable. The cyclone is tracking along the southeast periphery of the steering ridge to the northwest. Tropical Depression 15W will make a wide U turn and track more northwest as the steering ridge changes within 30 hours. The system will make landfall along the China coast just south of Shanghai. Now, here's the Joint Typhoon Warning Center's current chart on the system. And once uh, Yongdari makes landfall, it will weaken rapidly and dissipate due to interaction with the rugged terrain. Now here's a look at late cycle track guidance on WP15. Joy Typhoon Warning Centre has upgraded their uh, position to medium on another uh, invest and that is 94W. Late cycle intensity guidance. The Japanese Meteorological Agency still has Yongdawi as a tropical storm. No inflators on 15W. And central pressure on Yongdawi is around 994 and winds around 30 knots. In our next update, we'll have a look at Invest 94W. Upper level divergence, not as strong as what we've seen with uh, previous systems. Here's a look at the wind shear. The area in red is unfavorable. Favorable is green and yellow is neutral. The 24 hour shear tendency. The 850 metabar vorticity 
and it clearly shows where Yong Dawi is and 93 including 94 so 94 has a better chance of development than 93 now we have look at various models on Yong Dawi starting with the GEM or, or it could be the GFS the HWRF uh, the Chinese weather office has a blue warning in place due to the tropical depression they also have a rain alert and somewhere is expecting between 100 to 150 millimetres. The tropical tippets tracks on 15W. And in this update, I thought we'll have a look at the Tropical Cyclone Formation Probability Guide. We have Tropical Storm Hector over there in the East Pack. And we will be focusing on that one in the coming days. Here's the JMA's current chart. And shortly we'll have a look at the GFS model. It's available on the Pivotal Weather website. It's the precipitation. What I look for is the area in yellow through the dark brown. Scales on the right hand, the bottom of the screen. Apology for that. And I would also like to take this opportunity to inform you that uh, the Force 13's uh, HQ is currently closed. Nathan is now on his annual holidays and I hope he, he enjoys a break. However, we will be uh, continuing to bring the latest on the tropical scene and here's a look at the Total precipitable water, and will we see a Cat 5 system when Nathan normally takes uh, his holidays? He normally misses out on a Cat 5 system. But that's a bit of a joke uh, with uh, some of the members in the, the team. Now we have a look at the NOAA floaters on Invest 93W. And whilst uh, 93W remains low for further development, in our next update, we'll have another look at Yong Dawi and Invest 94. Force 13 outlets. We operate our own website currently under reconstruction. Uh, some fantastic uh, content across our YouTube channel. We operate two accounts on Facebook and three on the Twitter platform. If you'd like to have a chat with me, uh, David, or any of the others, including Nathan, it's Watch 13 on Skype, Phil 13 hash 9094. And if you haven't already linked to the AU channel, your support would be welcome. Bye for now.